Well, hello. Uh, my name is Michael Osborne, and I own and run a company called Astin True. Uh, I established the company in 2004 and started selling audio electronics in 2005. And I believe that I'm the only new audio electronics manufacturer in about the last 20 years in the UK to have started. Uh, so I'm told. I started the company because I have always been absolutely fascinated by audio and hi-fi. Uh, I'm a music lover, I love going to see live music and at the time I started it uh, I needed a change in my career and uh, I've always run my own businesses uh, and this is what I wanted to do next. Five years on I am now selling into 30 countries around the world. Uh, and seem to have a good brand reputation, I'm glad to say, and uh, we go from here. So what are we selling? Well, I started the product brand four years ago with a pre-amplifier, power amplifier and a CD. So very basic threesome. Um, we've come on a long way since then and uh, I'll tell you about a couple of the products that we make, um, which are sitting here. We have uh, a CD player, which comes in two types. This is the AT3500. Uh, it also comes as a 3500 plus, which is an upgrade we make uh, just to take it to another level. Uh, likewise, the AT2000 integrated amplifier uh, can also be plussed. Uh, so effectively we have four products here. And I'm going to tell you a little bit about our latest product which is the AT8000 which is a phono amplifier which I'm very glad to say has just got the most fabulous review in one of the magazines that we've ever had. Uh, and we're very pleased about that. It's been two years in the development and uh, it seems to be something that people are going to really like. So what have we got here? The CD player um, perhaps uh, says something about what we do best and that is that we manufacture products which are musical. Um, I've always had a, an affair with musicality. I'm not particularly interested in the nth degree of technical specifications. Um, and over the years I have designed a lot of my own products. In fact I've always made my own products for about the last 30 years. Uh, so this very much culminates in my philosophy of how to make products. Uh, all our products in fact have valves in them. Uh, we use them in a hybrid configuration. They're little tiny double uh, trio valves. Uh, not big heavy things that give off a lot of heat. Uh, we also wonder run them so they have a phenomenally long lifespan. No worries. What they do is to contribute to the quality of the sound tremendously. Uh, we've spent obviously a lot of time developing our circuits and there simply is, in our opinion, no better way of producing a quality music musical sound other than by using valves in conjunction with transistors in what's called a hybrid uh, configuration. The CD player, therefore, that uses a valve, in fact, in its buffer amplifier. We decided to use a box standard Red Book Philips uh, transport. Um, we have developed the DAC in our own particular way. Uh, it has um, a very, very accurate clock, which is very important, about one or two parts per million, which is about as good as it gets. And the ICs that are on the DAC run in Class A. That's then feeding a buffer amp, which is our own designed uh, hybrid configuration. And when we launched the product, uh, we very quickly got a lot of very good reviews around the world for it, uh, for its inherent musicality. And it's still now recognised as one of the most musical, and people say analog sounding. But time and again, people phone me up or email me and say that they just cannot believe how good 
the CD player is, which is lovely. It's nice to get some feedback and very positive feedback. When we decided to take it to the next level and make it a plus, which only costs an extra couple of hundred pounds, so it's a very good value upgrade, we uh, added a lot of little extras, which we've been, always been working on, and uh, again, the reviews have been phenomenal. It uses a much better quality valve. Uh, we take out all of the interlink cables and replace them with super pure single crystal cable, and there's a lot of critical damping. Uh, of a lot of the components and it transforms the sound again, which is very, very good. The integrated amplifier uh, is, culminates really from the developments we did with our uh, power amplifier and pre-amplifier originally. Um, the, again, there is a, a valve in the, uh, in the circuit, but in fact it's actually offering a quiescent current to the MOSFETs that are used in the power amplification stage, um, but it sweetens the sound and opens the sound up remarkably and makes it really a lovely sound, a lovely musical sound. Again, people say that and uh, we get lots of reviews. I'll just point out, I mean, just in terms of reviews, we, uh, we have one here from, uh, for the integrated amplifier in uh, Hi-Fi News, That's a couple of years old now, it's a 2008 yearbook, but it was uh, in this year's Ultimate Hi-Fi, so they obviously loved it. And again, we've upgraded this with uh, better quality capacitors and super pure cable, uh, and taken that to the next stage as well. And in fact, both of the Plus products sell outsell the standard product now. The just kind of coming back onto the uh, integrated amplifier again. Uh, this product is made with quite a few features. I didn't want to just launch a hair shirt product. There's absolutely no reason in my mind why you can't have a product with good features that also sounds incredibly good. Um, and it doesn't add a huge amount of cost, but it, was, it's, it has added, added flexibility for people to be able to use it within an, within an AV set setup, um, and indeed for multi-room as well. 